it all of a sudden felt like a hippopotamus had landed on my chest. And as the pain increased, I, the arms and the jaw and the neck also kind of shut down and locked down in a, in a particular place and the pain was extraordinary and I'd never quite felt anything like that. But also being a long distance runner, I couldn't imagine that it was anything associated with my heart. I either thought I was gonna die or, or fall asleep and I fell asleep and I promised if I woke up I would call my internist the next morning to get to the doctor. It's called a spontaneous dissection of my left main artery and uh, the lining of my artery tore and kind of had a ribbon effect through my heart and created three blockages. So I had to have a triple bypass. Every one of my friends were in denial as well. I'm back to running. Uh, my longest distance run now is much shorter than it was in August. I'm up to about six or seven miles. I'm also running much slower than I would like, but I am running, which is fantastic. Even someone of my fitness level, running multiple miles, a lot of long distance, lifting weights, having a, a blood pressure of 80 over 40 and a heart rate of 50, a resting heart rate, can experience a, a grave heart event like I did. I'm Rebecca Trahan. Listen to your body. Take care of your heart. You could be in my shoes. Well, I guess now I make a little room for chocolate. <laughs>